Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, my glam bag is here and I'm really excited. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create a look using the amazing products that were in my bag. They are amazing, you will see. And I'm also gonna explain a little bit about each product as I go along. Okay, so the first thing that I'm using right here is from My Couture. It is My Couture's blotting paper with salicylic acid in it to help you not only remove excess oil from your face, but to fight blemishes as well in the meantime without ruining your makeup. So I'm just going to go ahead and dab it on and remove all the nasty oil. And on to the next product from my glam bag. It's the Urban Decay Primer Potion. It's the same one from Urban Decay's Book of Shadows. This is the first eyeshadow primer that I ever bought actually and I still use it today. I love them. They're cruelty free. If you're a makeup baby and you're new to primer, um, basically what it does is it just creates a smoother surface for eyeshadow to stick on, making it last longer, and making the colors appear truer. And a little goes a long way. You really only need like one dab per eye. All right, so now that I've primed my eye, the next product from my glam bag is this full-sized eyeshadow that goes by the name of Sin. It's this really pretty creamy color that I'm going to apply to my lid and into the inner corner of my eyes. Now, since I got a dramatic lip color in my glam bag, I'm going to keep my eyes really simple. And besides, I'm going to be around like my family and my grandma, and I don't want too much eyeshadow on because then they're going to be like, Andrea, we want to see... We want to see your natural face. You know how they are. All right, so I applied it to my inner corner and my lid, and depending on your skin tone, you can actually, well, what I like to do is I like to take a little bit of, you know, shimmery, creamy shadow and apply it to my, the upper part of my, of my cheekbones just to kind of give me a little higher cheekbone effect. All right, so now I'm gonna add some dark brown shadow just to my crease, just really lightly sweep it back and forth. Um, like I said, I don't want too much eyeshadow on. So I'm just going to kind of keep it natural looking. And then I'm going to go ahead and apply some half lashes to the outer corners of my eyes like so. I really prefer to use half lashes. I almost use half lashes every time I apply falsies because they just look so natural and it's just easy to conceal them with your regular eyelashes. Alright, so now I'm going to put on my liner. I'm going to use some black liquid liner to make a thick, classic-ish cat eye just to complement my lashes. If you're bad at eyeliner, just practice 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 in front of the mirror that's how I got better at it okay so now that I'm done with my liner the next product that I'm using for my glam bag is from Tarte Cosmetics it's their lights camera lashes mascara you should have received a deluxe size sample in your glam bag and you may not know this mascara actually increases your lash size by 424 percent it's a proven fact guys I'm a sucker for any volumizing mascara. I love big, thick lashes. It's just my thing, so this is perfect for me. Okay, so the next product that I love so much, oh my god, it is not a lip gloss, it's not a lipstick, it is a lip cream. And it smells good enough to eat, but don't eat it, because you might end up in the hospital. The shade that I'm using is called Amsterdam, and it's this really pretty, vivid red color, which I think is perfect for the holidays. It's soft, moisturizing, and it's matte. I love matte on my lips. I just love this so much. Okay, so the next product that I'm using is actually really different and interesting. It's also from My Couture. It's called Pretty Full Blush Pepeel. I don't know, that's how it's spelled. I just thought it was. Anyways, it's blush that comes in the form of a sheet, almost like a blotting sheet. You just rip it out of the booklet and apply it like so, no mess, no brushes, no nothing. And the blush goes on really well and really easily. I thought that it was a really unique and clever idea from My Couture. I love it. Okay, so after that, what I'm going to do is just apply a little bit of bronzer underneath where I apply my blush and around my forehead and stuff like that. And for my hair, I actually decided to just leave my hair straight and down because whenever I go to my family's house, my cousins are always playing in my hair. So I'd rather just have it down. And this is my finished look from all the products that I have in my glam bag. I hope that you guys like it. For more information on any of these products, just go to myglam.com. And you can click the little link that says peek at this month and you can find out more of the product's info. I hope that you like it. Bye.